in this video, I'm going to uh, tell you a little bit about where did HLM package come from. Uh, well, actually, this piece probably should be uh, the first video instead of the last one. But uh, since I already said it, so uh, the first one, the last one, so uh, it's going to be the second one. Um, so what we are implementing is the paper I'm showing you now uh, on the screen. So. Uh, the theory was from 1996 paper published in the Journal of Royal Statistical Society, Severus B. Uh, the methodology is called Hierarchical Generalized Linear Models by Professor Yang Zhu Li and John Elder. Um, so Yang Zhu Li is now in, a professor in the Seoul National University in Korea, and John Elder was a professor in the UK, which is a very well known uh, statistician. Um, so this paper describes, if you are interested in, um, describes the theory and the hierarchical likelihood theory um, for the hierarchical generalized linear models or HGLM. And after that, uh, they developed a series of methods, extensions, uh, algorithms based on that. And then they published a book, uh, so this book, by Professor Yang Zhu Li, John Elder, and UD Parviton in uh, Karniska Institute currently in Sweden. So this is the book describing the theory and some examples. Uh, so if you're interested in the, uh, uh, some more details, and this is probably the book that you should check. And this is actually the reference book that we used for implementing this package. Uh, so we, are, so we, we didn't dis develop uh, this um, theory for hierarchical generalized linear model and H likelihood, but we implemented it based on uh, the published papers and the summarized in this book as well. So after, after we implemented HGLM, we also published a paper, this one, on the R journal. Uh, so a package for fitting hierarchical generalized linear models called HGLM. And so the R package is published together with a peer-reviewed paper uh, on the software R journal. Mm, so it's a pretty solid and well-implemented package. And it's useful for fitting very flexible random effect models in R. And, and we three people, Marsh, me, and Modut, implemented this together. Um, and it took quite a while to get everything fixed and nicely done and checked in R. So we hope this work is going to help you a lot on your research or applications. And uh, there are more examples coming in the later videos and enjoy using the package and thanks for watching.